Hello friends. Uh, today, today's project is working on. Um, this is a Mila. We're working on a Mila Jazz uh, upright vacuum, and I'm going to show you how to service the bottom part, the brush roll area. So. So first you have this one, this is the ruck plate, so this one is covering the bottom part, just like, like so. You've got six screws, you got three, the three big ones, they go right there, right here, right there, the three big ones, okay? And then you got two small, three small ones, the black ones. <clears throat> Well, you got I got one here. I think the other ones are down in here. All right, there's two more here, so those go right there. Okay. Let me get it closer there. All right. So now. Once you remove those six screws, you want to lift this rock plate from this, from here. Don't try to lift it from here because you could cut yourself. This one is really sharp. This area here, so try to lift it from here, okay? Sometimes this is pretty snug in there, so, so that comes off. Now, you see how dirty it is? You should... You should service this one like every six months depending how you know the use that you give to your vacuum so now you want to lift or you want to remove that those two screws attached right there to the motor okay I'm not sure if you can see it So remove those screws. Okay. Uh oh, it went down in there. Well anyway, so just now you want to lift this up. Lift it up from here, release this cap, do it, do the same thing on the other side, lift it up, and then you have this, this is where the belt is located, so you want to lift this one up, you, you open it from here, see that? sure if you if it's clear I'm gonna try to bring some light in there all right so now now that this one is open then you're able to remove the belt from the motor like so and then all this comes off see that Have the cover there we have one screw that went in there so those two go there okay those two so now we clean this really good and then we'll put it back together
make it more sand. And then we wipe the inside of it. Try to make it nice and clean here, clean as possible. Sometimes these bearings inside there they go they go bad and the way you tell is when they're really loud so I'll probably be uploading another video how to how to replace those bearings inside inside that uh, that motor there that one takes a little bit more time but it's doable uh, the other option is replacing the whole motor but not sure how much those motors are I normally replace the bearings inside and they're like new after we put new bearings in there <clears throat> Today is the last day of the year. Let's see, so I'm gonna show you how to open this now. Sometimes this can be tricky when you put it back back together, but I'll walk you step by step so you can get it right. Vacuum this, be careful not to vacuum that spring. It's very special.
vacuuming the belt, the groove. All right, I think now it's time to put this back together. Not sure if you can see from there, but I'm putting this. Uh, it's got this uh, extra part right here on this rubber, and this one sits on top of that gasket underneath. Let me see if I can see that. So that's how you want to put it when you put the motor back in there. This one should be this way. Okay. like that okay you can put a little bit of oil inside there just to kind of lubricate the uh, axle I normally put a little bit just maybe one drop of WD-40 there sometimes you end up spraying a lot just a little bit there And remember to have those springs there, okay? Because that makes tension when you when you put the brush roll. So let me just so this one goes there. This one goes there. Which one was up? So now that you have that, you want to put your belt. Okay. And then you want to put this one here too. This cover that covers the belt. So did you normally put this one here first? Okay. Just sits like that. OK. 
Okay. Now you put the now you put the belt. You attach the belt in here, just like that. The springs. Where do the springs go? Let me see if I can put this one here. So those springs, you see that spring? It sits right there. There's a little post. Let me show you, let me make it a closer. 